unforgivable. Kate heartbroken over Harry dragging her name through dirt in book on her birthday. Kate Middleton celebrated her 41st birthday yesterday, but if you blinked you might have missed it, given that it was somewhat, read, entirely, overshadowed by the drama surrounding the royal family. Prince Harry made a series of allegations against Kate Middleton and Prince William in his new autobiography Spare, with Kate reportedly not happy about his claims. Kate Middleton is said to be appalled at Prince Harry for dragging her name through the dirt, following the publication of the Duke of Sussex's autobiography Spare. Harry, 38, made a series of allegations against Kate, 41, and Prince William, 40, in his new autobiography, including that they encouraged him to wear his infamous Nazi costume to a party in 2005 and that the couple stereotyped Meghan Markle when Harry introduced her to the family. The book was preceded by a bombshell TV interview with journalist Tom Bradby on ITV, where Harry spoke in more detail about the claims he makes in the book. Although William and Kate have not spoken publicly about the claims made by Harry in the book, a source has claimed that Princess Kate is not happy about her brother-in-law's claims made about her and the family in the memoir. A source said, Kate feels that Harry's actions are atrocious. They continue to, she is appalled at him for dragging her name through the dirt and is finding it hard to forgive. Kensington Palace and Buckingham Palace have both declined to comment in the wake of the claims made in Harry's book. Prince Harry reveals furious texts between Kate and Meghan that left the Duchess of Sussex sobbing. According to Harry, Kate texted Meghan just days before their wedding, complaining about the outfit Princess Charlotte had to wear. Meg had a text from Kate. There was a problem with the dresses for the bridesmaids, apparently. They needed altering. The dresses were French couture, hand-sewn from measurements only. So it wasn't a big shock that they might need altering, Harry wrote in the book. He said his wife and sister-in-law are divided over Princess Charlotte's dress being not sufficient, page 6 reported. Charlotte's dress is too big, too long, too baggy, the Princess of Wales texted Meghan about the outfits, which were manufactured using measurements taken prior to a fitting, Harry recalled. She cried when she tried it on a home. Google Trends shows that this week saw a more than 200% increase in searches for Prince Harry memoir and order spare and that the 416-page book climbed to the top of Amazon's bestsellers list days before its scheduled release. The much-discussed book is now officially accessible to purchase on hardcover and as an audiobook, on CD, read by Prince Harry himself. With all that going on, it's no surprise that Kate opted for a low-key birthday, and she's reported to have spent a quiet day celebrating with her husband and their three children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. Notably, in a break from tradition, the Prince and Princess of Wales did not post on social media to mark the birthday. Last year, for example, they shared a series of portraits that had been commissioned to celebrate Kate's 40th birthday. King Charles and Prince William are putting on a united front amid the controversy surrounding Prince Harry's bombshell memoir. The monarch and the Prince and Princess of Wales have told aides it is business as usual and will visit communities across the UK on Thursday. The king will attend a community group close to his Scottish home, Balmoral, and William and Princess Kate are due at a community engagement in the north of England. Due at a community engagement.